Yeah, good morning, you guys. I'm so excited. I just love setting up for the farmer's market in the morning. And I was gonna wait for it to get a little bit lighter to do this um, video, but I thought, you know what? This is perfect because it's kind of spooky out. It's still kind of dark and everything. Um, and so today's um, day six challenge for emotional intelligence, the theme of October, is essentially fear and motivation, okay? Um, I remember being a kid and I was, I was running and I remembered feeling the fear of like a lion or a wolf or like a werewolf behind me. And when I embraced that fear, my, I was able to run further, stronger, faster. And, um, and it just, I remembered it exhilarated something in me. So it, lo and behold, fear is the greatest motivating factor for, our, for action. It's the greatest emotion for triggering action. Um, love is awesome. And um, you know, the dream of what we have is all, the carrot is wonderful. But the fear of losing things, including our life, of course, but also things that we already have is our greatest motivating factor for creating action. So um, I went to this wonderful Tony Robbins and Eric Worre event down in Las Vegas or something like that. This was a few years ago and their most powerful practice that they shared during that weekend was imagine if you do this epic journey that we're going on and I'm just transposing right now. If you do this epic journey right now and I actually put this into the seven days of Stoke, maybe you'll recognize it. If you actually do this hero's journey, this one year epic journey right now, what will that allow you to have? What will it allow you to do? What will it allow you to be? And really dig into that and feel it and this and that and the other thing. And then if you don't go on this journey, what will you be missing out on? And what direction will that be sending your life, right? Um, what influences on the people that you love will you not be able to do? What things in your life that you would have been able to have will you not be able to get? What will your health look like if you're not doing this? What will you see like all the different, and it's a really, it's a tricky thing because we don't want to be motivated by fear, right? We don't want to constantly be fear mongering, but there's a place for it. There's a place for knowing being real with ourselves and knowing what could happen if we don't do the do, right? So I'm inviting you today to consider emotions as a tool for you in designing a life that inspires you, that you absolutely love, that you're proud of on the deepest level because you're taking the initiative to do, to take the actions. Sometimes those actions are really hard. So does fear have a place in your process for triggering those actions? For creating the motion? E-motion is motion with an E on the front. So you can use your E-motion to create your motion. I wanna know what you think about that today. Uh, go ahead and share your comments below, of course. Um, that is today's October 6th challenge. Thanks, you guys. Oh, so fun. You're awesome.